scooch over. We're back. Uh, we've been on a little holiday sabbatical, no particular reason, except since we've been gone, we have got settled into our house. We've done a kitchen reno, and uh, this is just for the moment. Stella, I got a couple new cookbooks, and Stella was really wanting to try different recipes so out of it, so I'm letting her have free reigns here. She got all the ingredients out, and today, what are we making, Stella? We're making ava fudge. Jip so we're making avo fudge sickles, which is basically avocado fudge sickles. So Stella has gotten all the ingredients out, and we are starting with we're gonna put everything in the blender, blend it up, put it in our popsicle molds, and then um here, scooch over so Scarlet can be into. Both of you. Move the start and move your move your thing over. Uh, okay, so we're just going to put everything in the blender and then blend it up and put it into our mold. So, all right, Stella, are you ready? Yep. Okay. Sure. So let's start with this one. This is a cocoa powder. So how many cocoa powder? Scarlet, not yet. Um, nope, don't. Cocoa powder is one to two cups cup cocoa powder. So wait, one, one half. One half. One half. So one scoop of the orange. This. This one. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry about. Just dump it right in. How many avocados does it ask for? It asks for two small avocados. Okay. So we get two avocados. So at the end, I will say again what the ingredients are. Okay, squeeze that in there. Not do that in the future. It's all right. Great thing about trying new recipes and trying our hand in the kitchen is expect a little mess mm. and we're a mess. I trial and error. Yes, that's okay. We're a mess. Our kitchen is so mess. right now we are at two avocados. Right, you want them to be ripe. You don't want them to be hard. And. Half a cup of cocoa powder. Cocoa powder. What's next? Um, next is one half of maple syrup. One half. Maple syrup. One half cup. Yeah, here. One half cup. So, go ahead. Mom, I get it. Yes, you will get something here in a minute. Tell me when to stop, Mom. Well, whenever it gets close to the top. Is that good? No. I've had a lot of people ask me when I'm going to be getting one? these. Here, keep going. Getting these two little sous chefs back in the kitchen with me. So today's the day. Okay, good job. And this was a recipe that Stella picked out all on her own. When I see, I fall, I saw something. Oh, well, is Wiley No. All right, what's next? Um, next is one teaspoon. Hold on, did you forget the plant milk? What plant milk? The almond milk. Oh, cup. Plant milk. Three quarters. Three quarters. So, we're gonna, so we're gonna need three of those. 
Yeah. Well, let's do let's do one of these and then one of Scarlet's. Okay. Okay. That counts for two. And this and is the this third one. For one. There. Nice work, Scar. Okay, now we've got what's next? Next is one teaspoon per vanilla extract. Extract, yes. So one teaspoon. So there's two, you need two of these. So it's gonna be like this. Okay? And you can pour it. You can do it over like this. It might come out a little fast. How many of these am I? Two. And I got the other one. I can do that those two. I don't need that one, Oscar. Okay. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, you can do this one. Okay, good job. Okay, let's take that off though. Okay. Wait, no, no, that's fine. Go ahead, grind it in there. Okay, so this will be the next one. <clears throat> this is what the recipe calls for: two ripe avocados, half a cup of cocoa powder, three quarters cup of almond milk, half a cup of pure maple syrup one teaspoon of vanilla, and a pinch of Himalayan sea salt, which that we got that pinch, and half a cup of, um, it's, it calls for natural peanut butter, but we're using cashew butter. You can also use almond butter. Heavy cup, wasn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a heavy cup for a little girl. That's right. And I wanted to see it. Okay. You want to work the spoon? <laughs> yeah. Sure. Thank you. Um, I think out of all the comments of last year, what people liked the most was watching my girls taste test or eat some of my ingredients. So <laughs> I would probably say for 2020, the top one was Scarlett eating the goat cheese. <laughs> okay, so we've got everything in there. So now we're going to blend it. Yes. So I will pick this over and blend it. It's starting to be sweaty now. It might be a little loud. Got that blended. Blended. Now let's get the molds over. So we got little mini molds. We got rocket ships. And we have like unicorn horns. So with this, you can use whatever mold. It could be um, where you stick the popsicles in there because this is pretty thick and it will. Like, the popsicle stick will stay in the middle, but we don't have popsicle sticks, so we're going to go with this. Um, okay, so let's get a spoon. We are just getting ready for summertime. Mm -hmm. Although, <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but 
we eat popsicles and fudge sickles and all kinds of cold stuff year round. Right? So no matter what. No even matter. if it's ice winter. cream. Ice cream. We actually had ice cream this winter. In hindsight, I should probably I will say I should probably if you have these maybe put some coconut oil on them so they'll slide out a little bit easier. Are we going to do that? Mom? Yeah, I think we should. Where is it though? Mom. It's okay. If you're right next to it, I'll let you go. Oh wait, wait. Um, or maybe, yeah, that's what you guys can do. So. I'm this. <laughs> okay. So this is what you guys can do. Just get your finger wet or finger in there. Scarlet will have no problem doing this. And then just try and stick it all the way in there and spread it around. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's all right. Okay. There's something because you're laughing. That's right. Your tail leaps all the way to the top. Okay, that's fine. Maybe, Daddy, you don't need it. Can you hold that for me? Yep, thank you. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's like okay. Code. You want to put that in the freezer? Yep. I want to put that. Yeah, I'm going to put these in the freezer. This is almost like the um, like the avocado mousse type recipes. Okay, I have lots left, so we are going to save it. We will, yes, we will save it. Um, if we could, we would bring it over to your guys' house. There you go. If we could, they would love to bring this over to your house. <laughs> it is quite delicious. So I'm actually just going to put some, I, it's really rich. Put some in just little small cups and then put those in the freezer and they can always take those out and eat it with a spoon like an ice cream. Um, actually, I will show you. This is what we'll use. So I'm just going to put the rest in just little... And little Sorry. tiny mini cups. Little like tiny mini cream. cups. Yes. So now they will just have their own little personal ice cream once they're done with the popsicles. <laughs> okay. Well, this might be hopefully the first of many more to come Mom. with the cooking show back Mom, in business. We have one popsicle. Well, when they're ready tomorrow. Well, popsicles tomorrow. Oh, take um, a little. I hope everyone has a great week, and hopefully we will see you guys. You want to do this again next week? Yep. All right. We'll do this again next week. You guys Bye. have a great time. See you later. Bye. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. Happy Monday.